Hey guys, welcome to another Worth It video. This is a series where I buy bundles on the Dying Light 2 store, try them out, test them, see if they're worth buying at all so that you don't have to. In today's video, we're going to be looking at the Reaping Death Weapon Pack. In this bundle, you get a weapon called the Reaping Death along with its blueprint, and a weapons charm called the Trophy Harvester. All this will cost you 300 Dying Light points or $3. Now, the Reaping Death weapon, when the blueprint is fully upgraded, doesn't really do a lot of damage. But it does have 400 durability and 3 mod slots that you can use to increase the damage. So for me the damage can go from 570 to 753. Now the unique thing about this weapon is that it already deals 25% more damage to infected. But after every chase level it deals an additional 10.5%. So if you're on a level 4 chase you'll be dealing 42% from this one stat. And if you take account the 25% it'll be 67% more damage to infected. Now if this damage is counted when this weapon is fully upgraded, it'll deal 1,257 damage, which is a lot. So if you're grinding volatile kills, then this is a pretty good weapon to have for that. Now up next we have the Trophy Harvester Weapon Charm. From the name, you guys can probably tell what this does. For those of you who don't know, when you get kills with this thing and then dismantle it, you will get infected trophies. Now unfortunately, you don't get infected trophies after just one kill. So there's not really a unit of measurement I can give you guys. But on screen you can see how many I got from two kills and then how many I got from like a bunch of kills. I'll probably make a short video where I kill maybe a thousand infected and then dismantle it. So if you guys want to see that make sure you subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on that video. But yeah in terms of its worth I think it is extremely worth it. Like if I had this at the beginning of the game I would equip it and then use it until I got enough kills or if I needed a unique infected trophy. So yeah for new players this is especially useful since getting unique trophies is a bit of a hassle, it's a bit difficult. But this is also useful for pretty much every other player. I mean, it's not the quickest way, but it is something nice to have in the background while you're playing. I mean, if you guys want to know how you can farm trophies, I'll leave a video in the description. But this is a nice charm to have. It's probably one of my favorites right now. But that's it. If you guys want more useful videos for Dying Light 2, check out this playlist right here. It's got everything you possibly need from glitches, exploits, farming, everything. But if you guys simply want to check out other bundles and other weapon packs, check out this playlist right here. On that, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.